Yo what's up guys welcome back again to another Clash Royale video and today I'll be telling you the top 10 hidden features of the new update. So as you probably already know by now the new update will drop tomorrow 4th of July and by hidden features I mean stuff that weren't announced in the sneak peeks, they were in the gameplay that the youtubers from Supercell had and you needed to have an eagle eye to notice them. So, top 10 hidden features that I found really interesting, let's get started. So, in the number 10 spot, we have two small features of TV Royale. First of all, TV Royale has been moved to the battle tab and also it is now more likely to feature raids from the top uh, 200 players, which is good because that way we will see how top players play their decks and their combos. And I put them together on number 10 because there were some pretty small changes. Moving on to the number 9 spot, we have more achievements and those achievements are for tournaments. You get some gems if you um, compete in, some, in a certain amount of tournaments and you get some gems if you organize a tournament as well. On the number 8 spot, we have the ability to choose in which arena we want to battle. For example, if you start a friendly battle, you can choose in which arena you want to battle. Even from Bone Pit until Legendary Arena, you can choose whichever arena you want and you can battle in it. On number 7 we have the ability to sort cards by rarity, elixir cost and arena. This is gonna be very helpful for every player and especially YouTubers that wanna mix their cards and make different wood decks depending on the arena or the elixir cost. Moving on to number 6, Super Salt changed it so that the Dark Prince does not get a pushback if it's hit from a fireball or a rocket or anything like that. And that is really good because it's really gonna help out the P.E.K.K.A. Double Prince strategy. Number 5, from now on, if you visit a player's profile, you won't see their deck. You will see the deck that they have actually used in their last battle. Which is good because from now on they cannot hide their deck. For the number 4 spot, we have something that Supercell has confirmed and for the biggest tournament chest, the one, the tournament that costs 250,000 gems to create, the chest will contain a legendary card for sure. Thank god it will have a legendary, but still it will be so damn difficult to win that chest. Plus, you will have to wait 14 days to unlock it, so... Oh my god! For number 3, we have the ability to organize tournaments depending on our geographical position. If you're at school, for example, you can organize a tournament with your friends without them having to leave their clans. They can join the tournament just from their geographical position, which is perfect. Closing in to number 1, on the number 2 spot we have some information about the tournament. There will be 9 different tournament types, the smallest one will cost 500 gems to create which is about $5 and up to 50 members can join, whereas the biggest one which is the most expensive it will cost 250,000 gems to create which is about $800 in total, holy shit, but 1000 members people can join. And for the number one spot we have something that I've been waiting for so long and now when you request for cards you have to click two buttons to confirm that you want to request that card because so far so many times I misclicked and I requested for the wrong card. So that's it for this video guys, hope you enjoyed, this was the top 10 hidden features of the new update, I'm super hyped about it, tell me what you think about it down below, I'll be sure to cover it with many videos these couple days, personally I think that it is one of the best Clash Royale updates by far, but I wanna hear your opinions guys, so let me know down in the comments below, and make sure you subscribe, leave a like, and see ya in the next one. I'm still the same and I never change just to get a deal, but I'm ballin', ballin'. I came from nothing to something like it's nothing, yeah, you know I done it, that there's no discussion, bitch, I'm ballin', ballin'. I made a promise to my mama, I'ma turn these zeros into tens of commas, tens of commas. bitch, I'm ballin', ballin'. Closing million dollars.